Hi, DAC members. I'm Heidi, a biologist with Sea Shepherd. Today, we're helping close the loop on illegal fishing. These nets were detected, retrieved, and confiscated, and now we're here helping dismantle them. So one of the ways of finding out what kind of net you're dealing with is both by size of the mesh or by the material. For the Totuaba, the material stands out a lot. It's a much more expensive net that you can only find in the black market, and it goes for a lot of money. But aside from the material, which here you can actually see different types of colors, uh, the brown one, the lighter brown one, and this green one. But here you can literally see how big the mesh size is. When you look at these nets, it's a huge stark difference between the Tutuaba net that we just checked out. And so here you can see that the mesh, the mesh size is a lot smaller. They range anywhere from shrimp to corvina and chano. At the moment, um, we just had chano season. And so there's lots of nets that are from that specific fish. They're not illegal here in San Felipe, but if they are caught inside of the ZTA, then they are still confiscated. There are two different types of materials that you see here. Um, and it's the way that explains how nets work. So for example, you have these buoys attached here and they're the ones that tend to go up in the surface. I have here these lead weights and these are the ones that are used to help bring weight to the net and for it to be at the bottom of the ocean. So then it pretty much stands like you have the lead weights here, you have the buoys up here, and then you have the mesh that we had seen from the other nets all around the water column and then that's how fish pass through. So in order to properly process them, you have to remove them, right? Because if they're going to be put through a grinder, you definitely don't want to put these through them. Because of you and your support, we were able to detect, retrieve, and confiscate these nets. After grinding these down, they are then recycled into building material, staying right here and helping the community. Illegal nets taken off the ocean, the streets, and put to good use.